When viral symptoms underlie, there are home remedies to try. You find the one that works and snap, you're safe. And every product neath your sink might be a medicine to drink. No need for tests, the president suggests. Right, and then I see the disinfectant where it knocks it out in a minute, one minute. And is there a way we can do something like that? Uh, by injection. That a spoonful of Clorox makes your temperature go down. Your temperature go down. Temperature go down. Just a spoonful of Clorox makes your temperature go down. It's the latest COVID craze. Supposing we hit the body with whether it's ultraviolet or just very powerful light. A politician who distracts has very little time for facts. The scientists he's hired are perplexed. While Dr. Burks is about to barf and hang herself with her own scarf, he diatribes and recklessly prescribes. It sounds, it sounds interesting to me. That some pledge on your pancakes makes coronavirus pass. Coronavirus pass. If it gives you gas, try some bleach in your beer and shove a flashlight up your ass. Heal yourself with UV rays. Our president is no MD. He only plays one on TV. But of medical advice, he's always for. A little draino in your cup will clear your sinuses right up. And quench your thirst unless it kills you first. Slap your mom with a swiffer till her temperature goes down. Her temperature goes down. Temperature goes down. Spray your boyfriend with Lysol till he's six feet underground. It's the latest holy craze. Maybe you can, maybe you can't. I'm not a doctor. Since it's improbable you'll win with your hydroxychloroquine Splash some Windex in your wine and you'll resolve And you won't likely get a pill from Dr. Oz or Dr. Phil There's no, there's no vaccine Vaccine So try some Mr. Clean Sounds interesting to me. Maybe you can, maybe you can't. I'm not a doctor. You're kidding.